Hey everyone, this is Karan here. You're welcome to Tech Karan YouTube channel. And in this video, as you can see, we are going to take a look at Revenge OS 3.1. And this is the custom room based on Android 10 for Xiaomi Redmi Note 8. How to install this room? What are the features in this room? You also get the security patch of 1st of January 2020 with Google Play System Update 10. What are the features in this custom room? How to install and is Google camera working? Which camera you get in this custom room? Everything in this video I will try to tell you. So make sure you watch this video till the end and now let's quickly go to the video. <music> So as you can see first of all let's start with the launcher as you can see the wallpaper here is already telling us that you are using revenge os custom room and when you swipe right as first of all let me tell you i am using launcher launcher in this custom room but the default launcher which you get here is you get default launcher is a quick step launcher which is the by default launcher in this custom room but i have installed launcher launcher and third party gestures with uh, gestures with third party launcher are properly working no issue and no bugs at all and let me show you one thing by swiping right by swiping down you can see the quick setting styles but also you can see the themed icons the themed brightness icon themed quick setting tiles etc yes this room is by default themed i don't know how is there any substratum theme installed or i don't know about anything but yes you can get the themed icons in this custom room when you click here you can customize and you don't get many options here you get only two options hold and drag to add tiles and when you click here you can customize the columns columns landscape etc now let's move on back to other things first of all let me show you the camera you get the default camera is ANX camera not a snapdragon camera not anything else you get the MIUI camera which is clicking photos perfectly when you click on portrait it is not working yes no portrait working also let me show you something more whenever you connect this it will again go back and restart and it's etc it will not properly work there is no 48 megapixel camera option also so this is the default camera app in this custom room which you get here but the main thing is google camera is perfectly working when you go here you can click in photos properly working portrait mode is also properly working everything is working in this in this google camera so there is a this there's an advantage in this custom room that you can use google camera if the anx camera or any other camera is not working google camera is a perfect thing which you can use in this custom room now let me quickly show to settings now you can see the settings icons here which are themed also so as i already told you you get the themed layout themed everything i don't know how now let's move on to other things in network and internet you have these options wait let me show you yes so in network and internet you get these options and you get the woe wi-fi option available which is properly working you can see the call over wi-fi option is available which you can customize which you can add or disable according to your own preference now let's move on back to other things connected devices bluetooth apps and notification is in battery you have the option of battery saver battery manager battery charging light battery percentage these are the options you get here and when you go to display in display you have the option of wallpaper dark theme brightness level adaptive brightness live display screen timeout status bar ambient light font size double tap to wake these are the settings you get in display when you go to sound you get these themed icons are also here vibrate for calls dial pad tones etc these are the things you get here and when you go to other things like privacy you have the permission manager and these things here and in security pattern and fingerprint both of things are there and properly working no bugs at all whatsapp account and almost all accounts are working in google these are the things you get and in system languages gestures buttons when you go to gestures you have the option swipe to screenshot system navigation also just a navigation you can use the full medium bottom etc you can customize according to your own let's move on to 
other things in buttons you have the option of power menu just click here you have the option of advanced restart or screenshot which you can enable or disable from here and you get the playback control also in developer options you don't get any extra things it has some lags i don't know how i don't know why but this room has some lags somewhere some might notice i don't know why but these are the settings you get in this custom room and now if everything is done let me show you how to install this custom room on your device the main thing is you should be on MIUI EU room or MIUI any beta room you should not be on a global stable room and if you are coming from a global stable room then your system will be destroyed so make sure you have a MIUI beta room firstly installed as you can see my data is encrypted that's why i have to fill the password after filling the password what i have to do is just go here and go to wipe wait go to wipe advanced wipe dalvik catch system vendor data after that go to install here you have to install the room file okay here it is just select the room file and go to reboot your device will be booted if you want to install google apps which you might be you just have to boot into recovery again go to install and here you have to select the open gapps file select on swipe to confirm flash and everything is done simply reboot and this is how you can install revenge us on your custom on your device so this was all from today's video i hope you like it thanks for watching goodbye see you in the next video